Okay, another quick tutorial on lighting, uh, baked lights, and making lights uh, controllable. Uh, this is a scene I downloaded. Let's go and jump out of here. And if you notice, if you have your gizmos turned on, they're right here. You can actually see the lights, but if you actually click these lights, and say for instance, like this light right here, I actually have turned off. And for some reason, when I play it, it looks the same. So there's a couple things we have to do. First, if you look at each of the properties of the lights in these rooms, you click on the light, you look at the inspector, this is set for a baked light. That means that light has been baked in the lighting settings, which means a, a the bake process is actually burned in the lights into the textures of all the surfaces. So we need to change that to real time. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. Now if we run it now again, and we turn all these lights off. All should be good, right? And run it. What? It's still bright. Bright as shit in here. And we missed one. He's off. He's real time. Okay. So, what's the problem? Again, like I mentioned, the little clue these textures are already baked in. So now what we have to do is go to our lightings tab and just go ahead and generate lighting. Now you can see our room is completely rendered and we're now going to be using dynamic lighting. I'm going to move from my game display over here real quick and I'm gonna go ahead and select this little light over here in this back corner so we can see we're toggling it on and off. And I'm gonna change the game setting to display in the window. Instead of maximize, I'm gonna do play focused. And I'm gonna go ahead and turn the light on. Whoops. Turn that light on. We'll see its effect right there. Same with the other lights, let's go ahead and turn them all on. Go to our scene view. Select this light. Turn him on. And you can obviously see the effect now it works. Alright. Now in Playmaker, you just go ahead and drag your your these light components into your your FSM and you drag this guy and then you just toggle it on with enable. Alright, so it's simple as that, just don't, don't forget to rebake and um, set your lightings to dynamic instead of um, baked. Alright, hope this helped and I'll talk to you soon.